Well, what identifies a shark or a ray? Firstly, rather than having a bony internal skeletal makeup, they are cartilaginous. Although they extract oxygen from water, like fish, by using gills, they, unlike fish, have five gill slits or more sometimes. Shark skin is not composed of scales like most bony fish, but rather are an intermeshing of thousands of small teeth named dermal denticles concerning their navigation systems. Firstly, like fish, they have a lateral line system which runs along their body and like our ears, picks up pressure fluctuations only in water. They have an acute sense of smell. They also possess a sensory system that is unique to the animal kingdom, the ampullae of Lorenzini. This, located under their nose, detects minute electric fields produced by physiological, biochemical activities carried out in other organisms. Their teeth are varied for their different functions of gripping, cutting or grinding and crushing. Be them a wobbegong shark, whaler shark or eagle ray, but whatever, unlike ours, they are continuously replaced. In this 11th HD video instalment, I have put together a diverse collection of sharks and rays encountered over the year videoing at Cabbage Tree Bay Aquatic Reserve. Generally, wobbegongs are sedentary and boring to photograph, but use some burly and you'll be amazed at their performance. In a serendipitous way, as I waded out into waist-deep water, this wobbegong was attacking a catfish, and this set my camera rolling. You know what will happen now.
Because of their reticence, dusky whalers are difficult to approach to video. I have found Burley works exceptionally well with them. Stop thinning when you are above them and just drift down from above. Although Port Jackson sharks are often encountered stationary on the bottom, in going into the winter months they become sexually active and as these video clips give testimonial, provide some extraordinary movie clips. Baby, we will start to run. Rays are generally easy to video, but are mostly stationary or lethargic. So swim up close, which should get them up and moving. Eagle rays are summer visitors, and these two were mating, which gave me the opportunity to get in close to video. Shots of tequila 